little Mediterranean prawns. To prepare a red mullet in Amanori, I'll need some red mullet, of course, some prawns, zucchini, turnip, rosemary, carrots, some string beans, ginger, a few tomatoes for decoration, some uh, citrus juice and some Amanori. A little meat juice and some rice vinegar. We're going to start by making uh, some citrus juice, so sugar, rice vinegar, rosemary, lemon juice, orange juice. I reduce it all to a caramel. I'm going to remove the scales from the mullet and gut them, remove the fillets. I slide the blade very close to the bone. And there, make the cut. Remove the little sharp bones, which are very unpleasant in the mouth. Now I'll finish this sauce, just slightly caramelized. And I'll add a touch of meat juice. Now I'll make a little vegetable julienne. These are filaments from the vegetables, from the beans, which I'll embellish a little on this side. Little Asian sort of style. Make the julienne slightly crispy to garnish my mullet. Add some turnips, the chopped ginger, a pinch of caraway. Very important. Finally, the zucchinis, because they cook quite quickly. Place the julienne between two fillets. I fold one over. Now I'm going to wrap it uh, Japanese seaweed uh, style called amanori. Wet it a little. You have to be very careful when wrapping the mullets in the seaweed. Here I now place the prawns in a warm frying pan, not too hot, so as not to make the shell go too hard. In the same pan, I place the mullets alongside. I put the julienne in alongside. Now it's ready to be prepared for the table. I begin with the prawns. Little julienne. It's a whole art of getting the prawns to uh, hold up. Bruno, you've seen it.